Aquaba, welcome back to my channel. This is King Anand for those that don't know me. If you're watching me for the first time, I create content on this channel on how to bridge the gap between continental Africans and the African American diaspora or the diaspora all over the world for that matter. I'm originally from Ghana, West Africa, but been living in the United States since the tender age of 12. Okay. So I'm making this video because today, uh, this news has been, been going, going viral for probably about a week or now. So you, you all probably know about it. My 14 year old daughter told, told me about it the first time, but it's of a lady, African American lady who unfortunately used some type of glue, some type of industrial strength glue for her hair to put her hair down. I don't know. Y'all, you, you ladies probably know exactly what she did. But I don't know if she was trying to get her hair laid or whatever. But somehow she wasn't able to move her hair. Uh, I'm going to drop down some information in the description if you haven't heard about this. But recently, a good doctor, a doctor by the name of Dr. Michael Obeng, who is a plastic surgeon in Beverly Hills, California. Now, this brother is actually from Ghana. It's from Ghana right there. That flag right there with a black star in the middle. Uh, now his name is actually pronounced Michael Obeng. Obeng, say it with me, Obeng, right, Obeng. It's not Obeng or any other name that the, the media is, the American media is trying to say. It's not Obeng or whatever they, they're saying, it's Obeng, okay? So I'm very, very proud of the brother. He somehow said that he was gonna do the operation for free. This is an operation that probably caused thousands of dollars, but yeah, so I'm really, really proud of him. He, you know, we need kudos. It's Black History Month. Happy Black History Month, by the way. Uh, we need to um, congratulate black people in the diaspora who are doing amazing things. That's the reason why I'm doing this video. So in case you haven't heard of him, um, I'm, I'll try to drop his website link at the bottom of this video, his, um, his social media information, so you can check him out. But Apparently, he's been a doctor, a plastic surgeon in Beverly Hills, California for years and years. So I'm really, really proud of you, brother. Um, I just re actually reached out to him and his team to see if I can get an interview with him to see what his motivation and the reason why he did this solid for the sister who actually was going through this predicament. And it's it's unfortunate, you know, that it, it just goes to tell you the state of lack of hair care for, for black people in America. I mean, there is, you know, there, depending on where you live, I guess that there is a, a lot of a plethora of different choices for black women in this country. But for some reason, she decided to go this route, which, you know, the first time I, I heard of it, I was like, why would she do something like that with, with, um, what type of glue was that anyway? It was, um, Gorilla glue, right? Yeah, Gorilla glue is like some of the the strongest glue out there. It's industrial strength. And the Gorilla glue can be used to seal pretty much and to fix pretty much anything. You know, I've used it several times. So, but anyway, um yeah, I reached out to to the good doc and his people. So, hopefully they'll get back to me. As I say, you miss all the shots you don't take. So, Hopefully, I get to hear from them soon. Uh, if not, I'm hoping I get to hear from, from his people soon. <laughs> yeah, just keep your fingers crossed for me, for your man, because uh, I want to do an interview with the doctor to see, you know, just to learn a little bit about him so he can, um, you know, he can talk about himself because I believe that he needs to, uh, he needs to let the people know exactly what he's doing and the things that he's got going on out there in California, IA. So guys, um, yeah, I just wanted to get on here to let you guys know a bit about him. If you haven't heard about this, uh, check out the link below and um, hope you guys are having an amazing week. Um, I usually upload on Sundays, so make sure you check out my video on Sundays. It's gonna, it, on this Sunday, it's going to be um, a video about love, a lot of people's favorite topic. Uh, it's going to be Valentine's Day, so 
Um, yeah, check that video out. I think it's going to be pretty cool. Uh, it's about a couple. Um, well, a guy that I know, haven't met his wife, but uh, she's from Ghana and he's from over here in the United States. So I think it's going to be a pretty cool interview. So you guys check it out on Sunday at 8 a.m. Central Standard Time is when I upload my videos. So I hope you guys check it out. Uh, if you haven't checked out my YouTube channel, I'm going to drop the link below. So you can go ahead and check out. Like I said, I make content on how to bridge the gap between continental Africans and the uh, diaspora. So I uh, hope you're having an amazing day, guys. Uh, good night, and I'll catch you on the next video.